I don't know how many times I've been DM'd on Twitter and it's people asking me why is my phone running so much more slower after getting a massive software update? I've mentioned multiple things that you can do and it's actually shocking when most people don't know what wipe cash petition means. I won't make this video any longer than it needs to be but before we start, 2 seconds is only what it's gonna take for you to tap that subscribe button down below. And in those 2 seconds, 32 litre of water is gonna evaporate from the surface of the earth. That's a lot of H2O. Alright guys, so what you're gonna need for this is a laptop or a computer, your S20 Ultra, and a USB-C cable that can connect to your S20 Ultra. I'm not sure if it's meant to be USB-C to USB-C, but this is what I've got. Also, if the audio sounds a bit off, it's because I'm recording straight through the microphone of the Pixel 7 Pro. So this is a little two-in-one. Microphone test and a tutorial. So plug your cable into your laptop or computer, plug it also into your S22 Ultra. Then, what I need you to do, let me put my password in. What I need you to do is, for some reason it's, for some reason it's restarting. What I need you to do is completely turn your phone off. Completely turn your S22 Ultra off, like to the point where the power button doesn't even turn it on like, like this, completely off. So turn it off. As you can see, 500 subscribers. We just recently hit 600 subscribers. So keep subscribing, guys. We're getting closer and closer to 1,000. So now that your computer is completely off, not, not computer, now that S22 Ultra is completely off, hold the power button and the volume up key. Power button and volume up key. Hold it down and I'll tell you when to let go. Keep holding it down. I'll tell you when to let go. Let go as soon as you see this. You see multiple options. Reboot system now, reboot to bootloader, apply, blah, blah, blah. What you need is to go down to wipe cache partition. Wipe cache partition. You can select, you can go up and down using the volume up and down key. The volume up and down key will take you up and down to select different menus. So, wipe cache partition. Choose it using the power button this time. So the power button is for choosing it. Choose it using the power button. Wipe cash partition. Click yes. Confirm it. And before you confirm it, it's good for me to tell you what this actually is. So when you update your phone to a new software update, a massive software update, it still keeps some cash from the previous software. So that runs, that makes the phone run a lot less smooth because your processor still has to deal with the cache from the previous software and the new software. So what this does is it, get rid, it gets rid of the previous software's cache that is unnecessarily there. It's not the same as a factory reset, so it's not, gonna de it's not gonna delete your data, your files, nothing. It's not the same as a factory reset, it just gets rid of the, it just gets rid of the previous cache. So click yes using the power button and your phone, and your phone will restart by clicking reboot system now. So after your phone has been rebooted, you should notice a change in performance, mainly that your phone now runs, now runs smoother and less laggy. This is because your phone now has to worry less about the previous cache and data that it doesn't need, but it can now focus on the newest and most up-to-date software data and cache that it actually does need. Like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video, and I'll catch you in the next one.